Hello my darlings, how are we? Happy Thursday! And I'm going to say happy Thursday because it's currently 1am. Don't have a go at me. It's 1am, it's 1am and I've just finished stream and I thought, do you know what? I'm going to start recording now. I'm going to start recording now. If I get too tired, then I might finish recording tomorrow. So if there's an outfit change, you know why, but <laughs> I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm going to start the recording now, so that then I'm not in too much of a rush tomorrow, I apologise that the video wasn't out yesterday, my little, my little boy, Luca, he's, he's really poorly, during the day, I've, I've just been looking after him, and obviously, just, you know, he needs my attention, he needs my attention during the day, so I'm a little bit backed up obviously with recording and stuff so for now i'm i'm, re I'm recording at 1am but it's fine it's fine we're fine but yeah so 100 baby challenge i've literally just finished not so berry so i need to get into the mindset of 100 baby now but 100 baby i can't actually remember where we finished off oh i remember i remember we are currently on sunday evening which means that all the kiddies are going to be going to school tomorrow. For this episode, I'm really hoping that the teenagers are all going to get A's and we're going to be able to move them out. The poll results, we're going to be keeping Willow in the household to help with the children. And we are really close as well to aging up the toddlers. So, aging up the toddlers aging up the teens and hopefully going to meet a man's and getting ourselves pregnant that would be fantastic for this video let's shimmy on into game and we'll see we'll see where we get to let's go okay my darlings here we are back into the jones household so here we have our autumn so autumn is just chilling she's over here she's over here uh we have willay and we have ashley just here and we have david in the bedroom david is in the bedroom with i want to say crumple we've got crumple here and we've got mel over here as well and then we've got one of the toddlers just here who is lauren and then vanessa is over here who's very sad apparently because what's happened when toddlers crash oh okay that's probably why she was tired wasn't she but she's fine now she's fine so let's play let's play so first things first oh dear oh dear okay uh go and repair this i don't want you to buy a new one i want you to repair it oh somebody mentioned that what i should do with the bath is separate it into a different room so that then no stop doing that so that then they won't get embarrassed and then when they need a bath or a shower or something, we'll need to do that. We will need to do that. We've got 3,751 simoleons. So I'm thinking of either adding in another shower or another toilet next. But honestly, right this second, not right this second. Definitely not right this second because she's, she's currently doing that. But when she's finished and she's out of there, I'm going to make it into a different room. I, th I think you guys were right in the fact that I need to make it into a separate room. And it's fine. This is fine. So, uh, I just want to check that they've completed all their homework. Have they done their extra credit? Right, you need to wake up, do some extra credit. You guys also said to me that because I've got good grades as a lot trait, if they do their extra credit, and every they should be able to get an A on the first day. I really hope that's true. I really, really do hope that's true. So, what do we need to do? So, you actually need to be potty trained. So, that's what we'll do with you then and you you also need to be potty trained so we'll probably get will a to do that right can we please potty train them that would be absolutely fantastic why are you just holding her can you please take her to the thank you no 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 don't get in the bath don't get in the bath oh yeah you're embarrassed so why didn't you just get in the shower because now look what you've done look what you've done okay no, we need to we need to make it a separate room. This needs to be moved over by preferably a little bit more. We'll move this there and we'll move that there. And we'll grab ourselves. Yeah, we'll have to do it like that. That's fine. And now we need an extra door. The only thing is now, these are very, very cramped. I wonder if we could move one over there, one by the door. Okay, perfect. Hopefully, now we'll be able to do this. So she can go and take a bath. Oh, you're already potty training. Perfect. And then we need Willow to potty train Lauren. Oh, great. You guys, you guys are so clever. You guys are so clever. I didn't put wallpaper on the wall, but it's fine. This is fine. Okay, you're tired, so let's just get you out of that room. Thank you 
very much darling oh they've got school today this is so exciting this is so exciting oh hang on a minute some of you guys told me that if i get her to what do does she have to watch her sibling or does she have to <gasps> oh so does that mean it's gonna go up stop it you're tired but you, you know you'll live go for your bath sweetie stunning what are you doing what's with these sims darlings why why did you why did you walk in why did you go in just you know sometimes i just mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know right, how are you doing <gasps> yes sir okay this is good this is so good okay we're gonna get them up to level three and then we can age them up and then they'll be going to school wait what did i just get all that money for From child support payments oh my mods are still turned on i still got all my mods on is that cheating i have a mod where like the dads pay child support payments uh, i suppose that could be classed as cheating no you were so close to finishing no you were so close to finishing look i know you're hungry but you can do that when you've aged up and once you're okay i'm gonna get you to make some more bouquets for us to sell oh i don't like there we go that's better i was like where are me walls where are me walls uh, go and eat oh my god they've all got school in <gasps> please tell me you're not tired oh god you're really hungry so you need to wake up and you need to go and have something to eat the rest of them should be fine oh my christ uh, shouldn't they all be going to school now oh shit R wake up wake up wake up everybody get out everybody get out go 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 right now off your trot and i'll get them all to study hard wait what's wrong with you why are you uncomfortable low quality bath why do these people think that we're living in like a mansion why why are they expecting the best quality they're gonna go to sleep and then you can start making some arrangements Confront your bullies, sweetie. Confront them. <gasps> Look, we're up to excellent. Oh, you, do you know what, guys? I think we're going to do it. Okay, I know that you're hungry and tired, babes. But if you could, like, hurry up. You know, you're taking forever. Right, that's number two done. If we could just do one more, sweetie. Just one more. Could I, could I push that from you? And then you can eat. That could be your reward. Right, I'm going to wake you up now. And you're going to go to the toilet. So now, now what we need to wait for is the toddlers to get a level three and I can age them up, which would be perfect. We're going to do a yard sale with mama. Wait for all the kiddies to come home in like 45 sim minutes. Stock your table, darling. Just stock your table. Pen the table. Start yard sale. Let's go. Come by my shit. Come by my shit. I know you're hungry, sweetie, but I just need you to do this, please. Oh, a lot of grades are up. Hang on, I'll, I'll have to check. We need to check. We need to check. Did you? Yeah! <gasps> <laughs> we can move out to where the sim. We can move out David and Ashley. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Which means we can go and get her pregnant. I'll do that in a minute. Will A is now an A as well. But obviously he's going to be sticking around to help with the house. You two are both now B students as well. So I need to get two year levels to level four. Which is fine. We can do that with the vampire stuff. Yeah. <laughs> right, you're done with that then, darling. And so are you. Oh my god, they're both done. 2248. She's too uncomfortable. Oh no. Okay, okay, this is fine. This is fine. Uh, right, so what we now want to be doing is we're going to go over to Manage Worlds. We're going to put another man's into the household that we've got currently for the man's. And we're also going to download another house for the siblings to then move into now that they're done. They are finito of the storyline. All done. <gasps> oh, that means we're going to have two slots. She could have twinnies. Okay, so we're going to go over here. We are going to download somebody's shell that they've done which is very exciting okay so we're going to be downloading this shell this is by stella this is just such a beautiful build i absolutely love it so we're going to pop it in all furnished all pretty i'm absolutely loving how many men there are it's absolutely brilliant the next man's that we are downloading is by becky boo love you becky thank you so much darling and this is nate mcwilliams he is a romantic family orientated and ambitious and aspires to be a super parent. I mean, I don't know how far you're going to get with that swayed up. You know? You know? So, place household into here. There we go. Right, let's get back into game. David, David, my darling. You are now an A student. We are, we are finito, sweetie. I'm, I'm going to miss you. I really, really am. I don't know why I'm trying to move them out yet when I haven't even aged them up. Blow out your candles, sweetheart. Let's go. 
Oh, we're going to miss you, my love. So, David is a recycled disciple, a loner, and his last randomized trait is a vegetarian. Oh, no. Has it gone bad? Oh, we've used it too many times. Okay. <laughs> Where's Mama? Mama. Gosh, yeah. Okay. Uh, Let's have you cook. Let's, let's have you cook. Don't take a piece. Don't take a piece. Do not take a piece. Add birthday candles. Lovely. Right, Ashley, darling. Let's go. Okay, so Ashley's traits were goofball and active, and her last randomized trait is jealous. What you gotta be jealous about, sweetie? Yeah. Oh, coming in, babes. We're gonna need to sort out their outfits, aren't we? Through the table, standard. Okay, Vanessa is aged up. Her first randomized trait was a charmer, and her next is glutton. These sims have a greater negative reaction to hunger. Always enjoy eating no matter the food's quality, can eat spoiled food, and can rummage for food in garbage. I mean, it's not the nicest, is it? But, you know, you know. Vanessa, babes, where did all your hair go? Where did your hair go, bubby? Where, 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 where? Don't be stealing Lauren's limelight. Oh, my God, everyone celebrated Lauren's birthday and <laughs> not Vanessa's. Come on in, sweetheart. Okay, Lauren's first randomized trait was fussy. Her next is an animal enthusiast. Oh, well, I like that for you, sweetheart. Yes, I do, my love. Okay, we've now got no toddlers. We've got no toddlers at all in this house. So I'm going to go down the line. We're going to sort out their moodlets, try and make them happier. What am I, why am I sorting you two out? You need to off your trot now, loves. Off your trot. You've just wasted a plate of food. Split from household and move, darling. Ciao, ciao. Bye bye. Oh my God, that took too long to sort out. It was up a lava, but they're gone. They're gone. Ashley and David have now moved out, made way for new babies. Let's go. We've only got six in the household. Six of them. We still need to age up Will A. So we can quickly do that now. Will A has aged up. He is self-assured and a slob. And his last randomized trait, high maintenance. This sim, sweet arts, this sim. You've not done your homework. When have you two got school? In nine hours, you do your homework and you do your homework as well. You are all sorts of not okay. Right, read the book, darling. It's too uncomfortable. Right, grab that. Then you can go for a shower. Then you're going to be too tired. It's 2 a.m. I've let these kids get way too not okay, you know? So right now, all I'm doing, trying to make these sims happy because they're just not happy. And they are not going to do anything if they're unhappy. Oh no, it's 5 a.m. Look how tired she is. Yeah, I've proper fluffed this up. Oh no! Oh no. Okay, this is fine. You haven't even finished your homework, sweetie. None of them are going to be aging up, unfortunately. Not aging up, sorry. None of them are going to be getting A's at school, which is fine. I'll sort them out when they get home. We're going to travel and we're going to go meet our new man once you've eaten. This is exciting. This is exciting. We're going to go over to Newcrest, go to the Gilman household. Lovely. Go knock on the door, my darling. Let's meet our new man's. Oh, Nate, here he is. Take some photos. Perfect. Oh, they actually look kind of cute. How was their friendship? I mean, it's looking pretty good. Try to cheer up. Oh, great. Oh, well, this flirt's going to go down a treat then. Why are we in the bathroom? Oh, he's not liking it. I thought that he was romantic and all that sort of stuff. And he aspired to have a family and all that stuff. So why is he being like this? I need your sperm, so I need you to cheer up. Yes. Okay, he liked it. He liked it. He's feeling confident, so let's take advantage of this. Bold pickup line. Blow a kiss. Offer a rose. How is he romantic? He is not accepting any of my first kiss. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So he likes it when we flirt. Come on, because we need to get home. Yeah. I'm hoping, actually, that if we leave the kids alone for a little bit, they might sort themselves out. And then when we get home, all we got to do is, like, their homework and stuff. I'm sorry, who the fuck do you think you are, darling? Talking to me like that. Oh, you're so lucky. I just need the sperm. Honestly, apologise. Apologise. What am I apologising for? What am I actually apologising for? Which Joe up. Go home, darling. He's not worth it. He's not worth it. He's not worth the hassle. Just go. Just go. Uh, okay, I obviously came home at the wrong time. I'm thinking that I might just get her to travel because these kids are absolutely buggered. Look at them all. Whereas, look. See? Look at Willow. Yeah, we're going to travel again, I think. Right, should we try going home? Let's try going home. We'll see if it worked. If it didn't work, then I need to stop procrastinating. And I just need to 
sort out their needs okay this is fine this is fine so willa is fine right you are hungry so you need to eat you need a shower you need to go to the toilet oh the power's been shut off hey bills there we go uh and now you can watch the tv so now you're on level two let's get your homework done brilliant you also need to do your homework now you can go to the toilet and then you can do your homework uh, and you can also do your homework right let's get all of that done everyone's doing their homework lovely we needed to get her pre we'll have to get her pregnant tomorrow i didn't realize the time right how are you getting on babes right you finished your homework so you can go to bed oh my god it's now 1am hurry up and finish your homework please you're also on level two which is great so you can now have something to eat come on go read the book oh he's gonna wet himself if he doesn't hurry up look how close he is 98 percent why is he just staring at it oh no i'm so confused why are they just staring at it i have to buy another one now right read it babes oh my god it's 4 a.m right you've done that lovely you did your you did your homework oh they've moved it now yeah i really need you to read that book oh my god no go to sleep hurry up hurry up hurry up you've got to get up in an hour you guys they've got to get up in an hour there's no food left <laughs> you gotta laugh or you'll cry i promise you you've got to laugh or you're gonna cry and they've all got to go to school now i'm so sorry loves okay let's invite over our new friend and let's see if we can get some spoons he'll be right over ask to swing with no it doesn't that does not mean what you think it does okay we now yes try for a baby let's go are they gonna yes uh, how are you darling you're absolutely fine splendid pregnancy test let's go come on darling fingers crossed everyone fingers crossed <laughs> she's pregnant perfect us to just be friends stunning stunning he doesn't seem like the dad type anyway does he water's been shut off oh not this again it will resume wednesday at nine. Oh, great well she's gonna stink for the rest of the day then right let's turn this table let's sell this last one. Oh, i stink no one's gonna buy flowers from somebody who stinks buy my shit come buy my shit hello katrina hello darling oh thank you ever so much sweetie thank you my love okay what we do want to do though is enter the lottery purchase lottery ticket yes can he purchase a lottery ticket as well yes two chances yeah we got some a's who got an a you did and so did you yes we're gonna have some teens okay let's age up some kiddies let's age them up if they don't pass out oh god oh god yeah, okay, no, you're going to pass out. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, they all need to go to sleep. Okay, at, at least... Okay, you don't need to go to sleep. Oh, but the power's been shut off. Uh, okay, watch TV. Oh, my Lord. This episode's going well. Hey, at least we're pregnant. At least we're pregnant and we're aging kids up, you know? <laughs> right, you need to go for a shower, like, now you are fine you also you can go for a bath uh you're hungry so you can have something to eat you're hungry so you can have something to eat and you're fine which means we need to get this up so research vampires get that straight up to number four look how quick it's going yeah both if you read about vampires <laughs> oh look they need to f okay we're fine i don't even know why i was worried are you reading whilst on the toilet she's reading whilst on the toilet fabulous way to multitask my love okay she's not even reading the book and the skill's still going up you do you boo as long as you get up to level four i'm really not fast right i can age up these other two now though so let's do that you're definitely an a yeah brilliant right you blow out your candles fabulous okay so mel has aged up his first randomized trait was a bookworm his next is a cat lover okay okay well let's give you the animal aspiration then and then with you you need to add birthday candles and then you can blow them out as well so crumple's first randomized trait was cheerful and the next is jealous it's jealous okay well then let's be a serial romantic why not why not <laughs> add your birthday candles babes perfect pop that back in there lovely you've got class in two days so i'm not really fussed about you now so you watch the tv to boost your fun up you need to have a shower and then you need to go to sleep whereas you two you need to do your homework my darling class in two oh <gasps> it's 6 a.m oh no hang on a minute it's harvest fest they don't need to go to school but i'm gonna send them anyway i forgot that they don't go to school on a on a holiday do they but i'm gonna make them anyway 
Oh, did they not win? Oh, they didn't win the... Oh, that sucks. Power has been turned off for the next 12 hours. Are you joking? <laughs> Sometimes the Sims do make me wonder. They do. They do. I'm not going to bother with the holidays. I, I don't like the holidays, if I'm honest with you. Oh my god, I had to check that I was recording then. Jesus. You know when you have those moments? <laughs> right, now we're just waiting for them to get back from school. I mean, I highly doubt that they're gonna get A's. But, I mean, you never know. I mean, they're both on excellent. Did they do it? Oh, you did? Did you not? Oh, that's awkward. Oh, okay. Well, we can age you up. You come and blow out some candles, sweetie. Perfect. So, Vanessa is aged up. So, her first randomised trope is Glutton. And her next is a maker. Ooh. Okay. Master maker. Let's do this. Oh, they're all becoming good friends. This is so good. We might even move them out. <gasps> I wonder if she'll be able to have triplets. Like, with the option of triplets, you know? Everyone's now asleep. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Okay, it's not going... Do you know what? Yeah, it's terrible with their needs and stuff. But with the amount of kids that we can hopefully move out and then she can continue getting pregnant... It's all going well, my loves. All right, school starts in an hour. Sweetheart, you need to finish that food. Oh, man. All right, study hard, study hard, study hard. You need to stop doing that and you need to go to school. As long as we can age up Lauren today, then we should be golden. Third trimester in three hours. I'm going to get her to bake a birthday cake whilst they're all at school. Why is everything in my house breaking? We need to start upgrading things. All right, they're all coming home in like two hours. Keep our fingers crossed for them. Giving birth in question mark. She will. She'll be giving birth tomorrow. How exciting. <gasps> how many How many do we reckon she's going to have? Pop them in the comments. One, two, or three. Do you know what? Just while she's sorting herself out, uh, I completely forgot at the beginning of the video to ask you guys if you could please leave a thumbs up, if you could subscribe, hit the notification bell, and leave me all the comments under the sun. I would really, really, really appreciate it. You guys are really loving this series, and I've been really enjoying doing it even if I seem a little bit shit at it. But still, I, I'm loving this. They all got A's. Hang on a minute. We can move three of them out. Oh my God, how did I not realise this? I was sat here like, oh, we'll wait for Lauren to age up before we, before we sort them all out. But they're all, oh my God, I'm shook. <gasps> I didn't realise. Right, we'll blow out your candles, sweetie. Blow them out. Oh, I do wish I would sort of like made them a bit prettier. Okay, so Mel's very last randomised trait is cheerful. Oh, sweetie, you're going to have such a good time in that house. All of yous are. You're an A as well, so you, you blow out your candle, sweetie. Lovely. Right, so your last randomised trait is child of the ocean. That's a good one. Nice. Right, and then you, my darling. Let's age you up. Oh, Nessa. We didn't have you for long, my darling. Okay, so Vanessa's last randomised trait is bro. Right there, bro. Right, Laura, my darling, let's age you up. It's now Friday. We've gone through a whole Sims week in one episode. Oh, my goodness. Lauren has aged up. Okay, so her first randomised trait was an animal enthusiast. Her next is self-assured. <laughs> Rainbow hair. Oh my god, darling, you get your pride on. Look at you. Stunning. Right, let's move out. Some young adults. <gasps> oh my god, Vanessa and Crumple. This is amazing. This is amazing. <gasps> oh my gosh. What I might do is whilst whilst I'm not recording, I will probably sort them all out again. And then next episode, I can show you guys what they look like. Just because, you know, like when I upload them to the gallery, I do want them to look, you know, semi-decent. I, I don't want them to just look really random. I mean, she's due any day. She's due any minute now. So, and we've got room in the household for triplets. We've got room for triplets. You never know. That could go up to number 10. Guys, we've only got three of them now. Three. And one of them doesn't even need aging up. At least this sim weekend, there's only one of them that needed to get ready for school anyway. And if we get her ready now, before mama gives birth, then we can just focus on the toddlers and get them aged up into children before school. Before the school day on Monday, you know? That'd be perfect. Look at that belly. She gonna pop. 
She's huge. <gasps> She's gone into labor. She's gone into labor. Oh my God, this is so exciting. I'm so confused though. That literally came up and then just went. Like it didn't even show me. Oh my goodness. Look at that ballet. Look at the ballet. Okay, let's go to the hospital. Let's go. Have baby at hospital. Are we ready? Are we ready? <gasps> is it going to be one, two or three? Is it going to be one, two or three? Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, I need to find my page with, with baby names. If it's a girl, obviously it's going to be Lindsay. Oh my god, again? Okay, I request a different doctor. I want a different doctor. Why can't you? What would what you? Why? Like, why? It's just so unprofessional. It's so unprofesh. Oh look, she's going to have a quick chat on uh, on MSN before she gives birth. <gasps> she's in the gown. She's in the gown. Oh darling, you look so pretty. Oh, look how pretty. Okay, my darlings, are we ready, sweeties? Are we ready? Darlings, welcome back to Willow Creek Hospital with our very first matriarch, Autumn. Ain't she gorgeous? Ain't she gorgeous? Look at her. She has given birth to seven babies currently, and we've only got three in the household, so we've got plenty of room for triplets. Plenty of room. So we're going to keep our fingers crossed, my loves. Yes, we are. Oh, what's it going to be? What's it going to be? H2O. Oh, my God. Flashback. Oh, the things I think about whilst I'm waiting for birth, you know? It's a boy. Oh, my God. He's a little baby boy. First boy name I see is Drew for Melanie Ride the Phoenix. Drew. Drew it is. Okay, is it twins? Oh my god, it's twins. Okay, it's twins. It's twin boys. It's currently twin boys. Second name that I see is... Okay, the next name that I have found is Xander for Alicia. Xander. Oh, mysterious. Is it gonna be triplets? No, it's twins and it's twin boys. Oh, that's a shame. That's a shame. One, we couldn't name it Lindsay. And two, well, I mean, to be fair, we can go and get her pregnant straight away again. Because we've only got five in the household. Which means another chance for triplets. Fabulous. Okay, well, let's change that baby number to nine. Nine out of a hundred dollars. We're getting there. We're getting... Why, do, why do they do this? Why do they do... Where are you getting these plates from? Where... You've just given birth, darling. That'd be the last thing I'd be thinking about, honestly. Anyway, let's save this game and let's jump back on over to the chat screen. Right, my darlings. Oh my goodness, did we get a lot done today? Oh, did we? Jesus, we moved out five Sims. We moved out five young adults, which is just... I didn't think we were going to do that that quickly. No chance. We also gave birth to twinnies. We've got twinnies. We also had a yard sale as well. Managed to sell three quite expensive orchids. Very, very happy. And we also semi-renovated the bathroom. Semi-renovated. But yeah, so currently in our household, we've got Autumn. We've got Willow. We've got Lauren, who only needs to get an A at school and then she can be moved out. And we've now got two twin boys, Alexander and Drew. So... Beginning of next episode, we're going to be moving in another man's from the gallery. And we're going to be getting pregnant again, straight off the bat, straight off the bat. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember that next episode after today's, obviously, will not be coming out until Saturday because I've got no internet on Friday. No internet. How am I going to survive? Anywho, again, thank you guys so much. If you could please leave a thumbs up, if you could subscribe, if you could push that notification bell and leave me some comments down below with names for our next children, that'd be amazing. I thank you guys so much for all of your suggestions, your tips, your tricks, everything. I massively appreciate all of you. I hope that you guys have a wonderful day. I love yous. Mwah. Goodbye, my darlings.